Hey, how is everybody doing? All right. So, as you, I'm sure you all can hear by the sound of my voice, I sound like a dying horse right now. And my, my apologies for that. And like I said, I did confirm, you know, with my previous video. Yeah, I am sick, so please bear with me on this one. All right, this one is uh, kind of a different kind of opening. Mostly this channel will cover Pokemon, but this, you know, my original idea with my channel is I want to cover all trading card games discontinued and the ones that are still running and current to this very day. So we're going to do some MetaZoo Native 3 pack with the promo kind of blister pack openings right now. I have four of them and uh, I, I did have a few more. I kind of opened those. This was maybe like a month or so ago just so I could try it out. See how I, 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 I do actually really like the set. I have booster boxes of this product, but I don't want to open up a booster box quite yet. I want to see if we can hit some of these rare chase cards. There's 19 like cards that are desirable in this set. And uh, there are serial, serialized alternate art cards as well. So let's just, uh, you know, I'm kind of done rambling. I'm going to... um. Crack these open for y'all. Um, like I said, these these blitz packs come with a promo, and it comes with a, a coin. And uh, these promos that come in here, they have all been sig significantly different. So here's a promo in this card. Well, not huh? Here's a promo in this box. Look at that. We have. Yeah, uh, we have a a jewel. Um. This is an artifact card, and yeah, this, uh, I want to say, memory is right. This might be one of the actual, uh, chase cards as well that's on the list. <clears throat> um, and you get a flip coin of this set. And, um, let's see, what's the best way to explain this set without, like, you know... Getting YouTube to be angry at me. Um, I I'd, I'd say this is very indigenous. This is what the set is. Um, based off of heavily off of like Native American culture, indigenous culture, etc., etc., etc. But the uh, artwork, I uh, I really love the artwork. And these these cards, we're also gonna just immediately put these in top loaders and we're going to seal those up so it looks like we have two two purple coins already um looks like we got, got, got a gold coin and a red coin i'm not sure what other colors of coins they have for the set but i like how these coins are actual like i want to say i think they're aluminum <clears throat> see i'm not sure if we yeah we don't even have this promo yet i'm not even sure if these are promos on here or not but that's pretty cool chibi wendigo hollow and again these these will all be hollows but let's get the packs all kind of neatly organized let's open up this one too like i said Kind of being conscious right now on on the time because I don't want these to be too long. If I feel like I want to cut the video out and sh like have it be short, then uh, I'll definitely give you all a heads up. Oh man, we got all right. And again, I'm not one that's gonna be talking about like budget and finance and investing as much on this channel. But what I do know is there are cards in here that uh, peaked, just kind of skyrocketed in, in uh, value on the secondary market. And these ones, these jewels, I'm going to have to look at um, kind of behind the scenes of everything. And then, um, yeah, so we'll we'll put these two to the side. And again, this, this is a trading card game. Um, this came out in 2020, and, um, there was a, 
<coughs> excuse me, there still is a huge fan base, but and now, now it's slowly starting to become a small kind of niche fan base. All right, so I'm just going to flip through these. Um, appreciate the uh, the artwork. It's kind of a different style of artwork. It's, it's, it's kind of like it wants to be a retro. But this is one of their latest sets. Oh, man. We got a Dreamcatcher Hollow. I'm going to have to check the price point on that later on. Yeah, no, that's... Wow. I, I pack, pack one. I want to say pack one. Fire. Pack one. Fire so far of MetaZoo Native. And it's it's mainly this this set. Even without pulling, like, anything special. Um, what MetaZoo is all about... For, for those that actually want to collect this card game, is you got to find, you got to get the hollows. The hollows is uh is, is what's going to bring in money. And what's, what's cool about the reverse hollows again is it's only the character that's featured on the artwork that, that gets that hollow treatment for the reverse hollows. Man, I wish that was a hollow. That necklace. I, I want to say, I think people are chasing these artifact cards from the set and uh hopefully we can uh pull some again these packs it's kind of a different kind of it, it, it's like a, a foil wrapper so for some of you that have not opened up anything meta zoo just if and if you decide to try it out just giving you a heads up here you got to put a little bit of a oh we got a reverse hollow of the necklace yeah, right now we're, uh, uh, you know, I've, my experience with MetaZoo so far is, uh, yeah, it's, it's hollows where you get those chase cards or bust. <coughs> I know the, one of the first things that comes across my mind is the MetaZoo Seance kit, not kit, the Seance set. When you open that up, see, got another reverse hollow, like, Man, we, we need to get, I don't think Caribou Mother really means a whole lot. Same with this Nega, um, whatever that is. Um, they, <clears throat> those ones aren't chase cards at all. Um, anyways, kind of going back to MetaZoo Seance, <clears throat> man. A lot of people have just been getting, just been pulling, like, from what I heard, kind of through the grapevine on things, is the pull rates are hard on the hollows. Um, I know that a lot of people, <laughs> including myself, you buy a booster box, and what, you know, honestly, what does suck, excuse my language on that for some of my younger viewers, is uh, what, what, what sucks is... Spend money on a box and like you get nothing but reverse hollows. That's what MetaZoo Seance is on, you know, just a short discussion there. This one, I'm going to have to take a look at that hollow again um, behind the scenes on things. And like I said, I, I really don't want this video to be too long because, uh, you know, it's it's this is one of those card games where... <clears throat> You're going to like it. You're going to like the playability. It's definitely unique in that nature because this card game revolves around you and your surroundings. Ghost Dance. That is a pretty sweet hollow. <clears throat> Man, we, I just wish we had, I just wish we could keep on getting more hollows. <clears throat> but hey, I'm, I'm actually, you know, I'm not even going to complain about it because, you know, I, I get to enjoy pack cracking native uh booster packs which i've been on the fence for a while now on um if, if i should open up a booster box of this or try to just open up the blister packs because basically you don't know what specialty card you're gonna get or what what hollow card you're gonna get because they keep them facing on the back side so all you see is the uh back surface of the card inside the package um but i will say you know for what it is 
this uh this pack cracking um video i i i I'd, I'd say that this this is pretty decent i just wish dang birth of the sun <clears throat> see this is something i i'm i'm going to have to take a look on the back end of things um yeah this is just i just want to get more experience with native um with the set and uh i guess depending on how i feel tonight like i i'm definitely gonna s sit on this for a while of uh should i open a booster box of this or not so i'm, I'm just <coughs> oh, excuse me oh man if this if this was a hollow i want to say this is kind of one of the big ones to get in a hollow Oh my gosh, like, it's cool even getting, like, a non hollow in the reverse, but man, this, what, again, what, some of y'all just need to know that about MetaZoo is literally just hollows, 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 because <clears throat> you can buy some flip hollows, and even when you get the Big chase cards. So let's, let's see. So that was twelve packs, MetaZoo native, and like I said, I'm I'm feeling a. My thoughts and feelings right now, just having this experience of actually getting the the opportunity and chance of opening multiple MetaZoo native products or not products booster packs. You know, I I, I my, I'm like eighty five percent feeling pretty good about this you know my <clears throat> and especially this is just for like documentation purposes as well i i'm i'm, I'm feeling pretty good with uh, about this but i'm especially feeling really good about these two hollows definitely feeling good about these hollows as well but no it's it's these these two are the ones that <clears throat> i'm gonna take a look on the secondary market like I'm going to be looking at eBay, TCG Player, and some of those other websites, and I'm going to compare prices, and uh, even some of the hollows in here, I'm going to sleeve up and whatnot. Even just in, any rare card, you'll you'll know that it's a rare, because it's going to have like a hollow star. And uh, yeah, I, I'm going to sleeve all those, I'm definitely going to sleeve these up behind the scenes on things and I'll 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 do like an update video on all this stuff later and again like here I just just for documentation and camera pur pur purposes these are aluminum coins and uh like that that sounds good and uh sounds good it feels good to even try to flip them too so yeah <clears throat> I'll I'll explain more about the the game mechanics of MetaZoo I know I, I I touched just a, a tiny bit like I bit like I I don't think I even scratched the surface on the gameplay but this literally takes your entire environment literally for real like cards will have special bonuses if it's in the morning or if it's in the afternoon late afternoon dusk dawn um where where you are like if you're outside or indoors. Even like clothing items, like if you're wearing glasses, or if you do have glasses, cards get bonuses for that. Or if you uh, simply wear a, like a flap rim cap. Or uh, if you're wearing sneakers, or if you're barefoot. Like just insane, odd, quirky gimmicks, but just that little evolution of the car game. Like you are a part of the car game, which is pretty sweet. So, um... <clears throat> <clears throat> That's kind of MetaZoo kind of really, really, really shortened down. But uh, I'll see you all in the next video. Stay safe. Have fun, everybody. This is just going to kickstart the weekend because after this MetaZoo, I said, what, we're going to be diving through that One Piece gift collection. We have a Paradox Rift. And then uh, I, I think I do have a Digimon box from like last year that I do want to open so I can put that with my other Digimon stuff. I got some Dragon Ball stuff. Ah, I got some Dragon Ball Z stuff I want to cover too. So just, I'm starting to get into the rhythm of the flow of featuring other different card games. Because I kind of want to cater to all the card games. So, um, 
yeah, I'll see you all in the next video. Peace. Deuces forever.